And newly released body camera footage showing officers talking with a man accused of breaking into a home in Monroe and assaulting a woman as she slept. He was found incompetent to stand trial earlier this week. Our Courtney King breaks down the new footage and 911 calls you'll only see right here on Fox 19 Now. Yeah, Rob, a judge explained Ashru Tamal suffers from a severe mental illness. He faces several charges, including burglary, kidnapping, abduction, and gross sexual imposition. The video we have shows him speaking with officers, and he repeatedly tells them someone told him to go into the home. This newly released 911 call was made just moments after a man allegedly broke into a Monroe home and assaulted a woman. Yes, he's down there right now. The woman on the line asks for officers to hurry and says the man woke her up. Authorities identified the man as Octu Dimmel and says the victim and her family fought back and detained him until officers got there. Yes, he's in my house That's in the basement. Of one of the rest. A Butler County judge says Dimmel is suffering from a severe mental illness and is incapable of understanding the proceedings against him. What's your name? Octu Dimmel. Huh? A divan. In the body cam video, Dimmel tells officers there's something wrong with him. That is my house. Go inside. And my mind is crazy. Your I mind's think. crazy? Yeah, my mind is crazy. I am inside the prison. Officers ask him several times how he got inside the home. He tells them his house was locked, so someone told him to go into the family's home, but he doesn't say who told him that. The garage is open. Somebody tell me to go inside. That's why I go inside from the garage. He also tells the officers he knew the family had a daughter and it was another reason he went into the home. Like a court friend, that's why Jensen is going inside the house. The officer tries to use a translator app with him because he said English is not his first language, but he wouldn't speak in his native language. Are you on any medication or anything? Yeah, in the bag of inside my bag. Officers take him to the police department and a sergeant asks him similar questions and he maintains his story. How did you get into the house? Somebody sent me or so tell me that is my house go inside. And that judge ordered them all not to be released, but instead get treatment at Summit Behavior Health Care for the next year or until his competency level re increases so he can stand trial. Damal is scheduled to appear before the judge again on February 10th, 2025, but he could be back in court sooner depending on his progress in restoring his competency. Rob. All right, Courtney, thank you very much.